Welcome friends, I'm Scientist Joe bringing you November's Experiment of the Month. I am broadcasting you from my kitchen. Uh, and no, I didn't shrink since the last time you saw me. I'm in a slightly bigger kitchen this month. I moved. Uh, but no matter what the size of your kitchen or laboratory, you should be able to do November's Experiment with no trouble. Here's what you'll need. Cranberries are uh, tart and delicious and a chemical indicator. They can tell us if something is an acid or a base. <clears throat> Cranberry juice is an acid when it comes out of the bottle. Baking soda is a base, and a base is sort of the opposite of an acid. So when those two things come together, you'll notice a reaction. And this is bubbling up an awful lot. So, while we're waiting for the bubbles to go down, maybe I can tell you my favorite Thanksgiving story. So, Aunt Sylvia was running late Wednesday night, and she didn't catch a flight to get in. So, Thursday morning, my dad had to wake up at 5 o'clock, and he had to run all the way out to St. Louis to try to get He had no minivan, no minivan was not the grave. He couldn't break down. You can't row a gravy boat unless you're in a gravy river. The bubbles are gone and that color has definitely changed. Now, what's going on? Is the cranberry juice sad? No. When the baking soda goes into the cranberry juice, it makes it more basic and this dark color starts to show up. This chemical reaction is reversible, though. So, I'm going to take uh, about half of this and put it into another bowl. And I'll tell you why I'm doing that in a minute. That looks like half. Uh, to this bowl, I'm going to add 150 milliliters of water. Okay. We're going to set that aside, that aside for a minute. And to this bowl, I'm going to add 150 milliliters of white vinegar. <clears throat> now, there's baking soda in here, and this is vinegar. <sighs> baking soda and vinegar mix, and we get a sort of a bubbly eruption. So, in order to make this work, I'm going to go very slowly as I do this, pour the vinegar in there. You see, we've definitely got some bubbles. Keep going. Very slowly. And as it pours in, you can see, this is cranberry juice with baking soda and vinegar added. This is cranberry juice with just baking soda. So you can see, this is a base and this is an acid, and the cranberry juice has changed colors as it's gotten more acidic or more basic. Now that we're done with it, it's probably okay to drink this stuff, right? Don't even think about it, you turkey! It is not a good idea to drink your science experiments, uh, but everything in here can be washed down the sink, no problem. It won't be dangerous for your drain. Hey, if you want to learn how to do this experiment, you can go to our website, sciencefun.org. You can find a link to it really easily. You can find it... Uh, ah! Found it. Right there. Go to our website, check out science camps, in-school science field trips, and birthday parties at our lab. Uh, there's more experiments you can do. Check out our Facebook page. If you do this experiment and you want to show us, you can send a picture or a video to us. Facebook page, email address, any way you like to do it. Thanks a lot.